Attorney General Leslie Rutledge says Arkansas will be leading the way on Monday in front of the U.S. Supreme Court. It's a lawsuit against another state, one she suspects stole millions of dollars that should be in state coffers. Andrew Epperson in the studio with more on this. And Andrew, what does she think happened and what are the chances of getting this money back? It's good questions, Bob. Rutledge says Delaware kept funds from dozens of states, including Arkansas. She says the northeastern state, Delaware, used around $250 million to balance its budget. That money coming from unclaimed money orders. Now, these came from people who wrote up money orders from 30 different states through the company MoneyGram, but the orders were never cashed. Rutledge says this can happen when the recipient dies or moves. Rutledge says Delaware claimed around $250 million in unclaimed money orders. That money truly belonging to multiple states. That includes Arkansas. Delaware, it appears, was using this money that belonged to other states, but using it to offset and to balance their own budget. Using Arkansans money to balance the budget. Rutledge's office is leading the argument in front of the United States Supreme Court next Monday. The case, Arkansas versus Delaware. Rutledge says this case is significant because it'll be Kentonji Brown Jackson's first day as a sitting justice after being sworn in back in June. And Rutledge says she doesn't yet know exactly how many Arkansans were impacted nor the exact money amount. If Arkansas wins, Rutledge says the state will need to identify who gets the money that's been unclaimed. Live in studio, Andrew Epperson, KARK 4 News.